hello students so in this video we are going to see a short explanation of this question which many many students have personally messaged me in instagram and telegram so welcome to crack down with your mst myself dr madhuri shinwas your dermatology faculty in this wonderful cerebellum academy app this is the today's question so you can see a factory worker presents to the dermatology opd with the lesions present over the finger which are painful and pruritic and if you closely observe the lesions are deep seated vesicles deep seated vesicles which are present over the palms so next clue which is given in the question is that there is a history of recent change of rubber gloves and one more clue which is given is he has had such lesions developed previously with the same brand of the rubber gloves so with all these clues given in the question if you have marked the answer as option c form folix you are absolutely correct please remember whenever there is a, any person coming with deep seated vesicles which are present over the palms sides of the fingers and with the complaints of pain or itching pain and itching then you must always think of this diagnosis which is form folix which is also called as dyshidrotic eczema dyshidrotic eczema okay and this deep seated vesicles the terms which are used to describe this are sago green appearance so hindi mein sabudana bolte hain sago green appearance or tapioca appearance tapioca appearance okay so now some students were asking why are the rubber gloves mentioned in this question so please see here carefully form four legs there are various triggering factors for form four legs out of which please see what i'm highlighting yes allergens and irritants exposure can also trigger the form four legs and among them you can see rubber materials is also one of the triggering factors so this is the reason why this is precisely form four legs the answer but not allergic contact dermatitis please remember if the answer has to be allergic contact dermatitis then the examiner would have given this kind of a clinical picture where you are able to see there is scaling and there is scaling and erythema present over the fingers there can be scaling or there can be erythema if it is acute form of eczema okay and why are the other options not the answers very simple the age group blistering distal dactylitis and bullous sympatico they are commonly seen in young kids young kids and also apart from that even the there are various other points blistering distal dactylitis will manifest as large blisters large blisters with pus like consistency present inside those blisters okay and there is a infectious origin for this blistering duct distal dactylitis next is bullous sympatico i hope you all know about this so this is characterized by large blisters and this is again infectious could be due to staphylococcus or streptococcus okay i hope you have understood why the answer in this question is form folix and why is it not allergic contact dermatitis thank you so much for watching the video till this point happy learning sarvam sri krishna arpanam sarve jana sukhino bhavantu